Uh, yeah, like if you were to pick the first one. I'm obsessed with it. If you were to pick the first this one that you so mentioned, cool. like Norman freaking ate the gum right away. So many people have eaten the gum. Did yeah, anybody open the Rad Dudes? I don't even know what yes. that is. Rad Dudes has been opened two, two times maybe. Is it I, a terrorist attack? I don't buy that. Well, you know who just opened terrorist attack? Kurt Metzger. Dude, that's so... Damn, yeah. I fucking busted my fucking Oh, load. that's what happens. Terrorist people, attack. People, people choose too early. What? Comedians open cards! So many cards, no coffee outside the stand Wednesday night. I think everyone is hanging because freaking Tony Hinchcliffe is in town. But who do I have now? Chris Vega. Chris Vega. Oh, I freaking heard your name. I just don't know your freaking face because I, I listen to shit. I don't watch it. Okay. Kick ass. Chris Vega. Excited. Well, I don't watch any. I just, I want it. Whatever. Okay. So I got all these cards. Um, you just... Growing uh, Pains cards, that's fucking crazy. Yeah, Norman opened Growing Pains. Um, who else? Um, Ari Shapiro opened Growing Pains. So you just, you flip through. Robocop too. Howard the Duck cards. Oh my yeah, there's God. a lot of shit. Holy shit. Yeah, you pick one, you open them, you talk about them for as long or short as you want, you sign one for me, you keep the others if you so desire. Okay. Holy shit. And how long you been doing comedy? Nine and a half years. Awesome. Yeah. And you, you must love New York. I mean, I'm from New York. Right. Born and raised. X oh. oh, the X-Force part. This is it. Oh, awesome. No one's ever opened X-Force. Uh, hell yeah. Perfect. I'm excited. No, that's, I am too. I love when people open new cards. You know, because I have multiple packs of the cards. Did he pick Robocop? No, he picked X Force. Oh hell yeah! Yeah, yeah. I want to see that. X Force. Yeah, let's see. I don't even know what. These What's your name? Aaron. Aaron, and you're a comedian too. I am. Awesome, and you're always around the skanks, I think. Yeah, a couple people are giving the wishy-washy thing about that, but I think they're just joking. All right, Wild Side. This is the. Uh, Women aren't funny. Barrel. Yeah, they are. Looking. The, the the milf. That's a good. The milf. The milf. That's a good. <laughs> Just because it has red at the top doesn't mean... No, it says the milk, right? No, I, I, I get you. Yeah, I know. New Liberation Front, the milk. <laughs> uh, cable. Oh, these are all the... Are those stickers? stickers? No, these or are, are they all, just cards? They're just cards of the X-Force comics. Oh, the, they, the way that they have that cut, it domino. almost looks kind of cool. Yeah, yeah Domino. That's my girl. Mm. Gave me a lot of boners as a child. Oh, wow. I got a little Deadpool action. I just... That's what made me... I watched that You Deadpool. were open for Deadpool? I was... I opened the Deadpool... I watched the Deadpool Wolverine movie yesterday. And they made fun of Rob Leefield, who did all this art. Oh, wow. So really? in the movie... In the movie, they made fun of the artist? So they made fun of this, the artist who created Deadpool, who created X-Force, who gotcha. wrote X-Force. And he's notoriously bad at drawing feet. As you can see from the cards, there are almost no feet. That's oh, wow. a poorly drawn foot. He needs to work with that freaking so shoe, Pulp Fiction director guy, and they can get the feet going. The shoe store at the end of the Daredevil, uh, the Deadpool Wolverine movie is called Leefield's Just Feet. And oh, that's wow. what that's what made me look. No, there's no. They, they notice how the feet are all cut off. He doesn't have wow. to draw feet. feet. Yeah. What an odd thing. Yeah, it's very strange. Wow, like he never had time. Like in all his art drawing classes, he was focused on the, the torso and stuff. and never worked on it the feet. Strange. And some of the torsos are bad. He has a notoriously bad strange. Captain America drawing where it looks like Captain America has triple E tits. Is it wow. Yeah. Well, how did he get the gig if he's so bad at drawing? It's the 90s, so it looks kind of cool, and nobody fucking figured out, like, look how bad the feet are back then. Interesting. Nobody figured out he was bad because he was doing all the detailed speed line shit, and then he wrote Youngblood for Image, which was their first book, and it bombed oh, compared to all the other Image launch types. Oh, wow. Yeah, like, Just literally one panel would be daytime, and the next one would be nighttime, because he could draw cool pictures, but not be consistent. Uh, continuity issues in drawing. Yeah. I understand it with movies, but how do you do that with drawing? That makes no sense. It's yeah. insane. It's, it's, it's wow. panel to panel continuity issues. Wow. It's like a Fast and the Furious movie. Yeah, I think I've heard of those things. With the uh, cars and stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah they made, like, a ten, ten of them or you something. You seem like you'd be into cars. But mostly looking at him and talking about him, not really like driving. I, I like actually driving. Why? Because I like it's five hours, five and hours and change to get to New York for me. Where do you live? New Hampshire. Okay, all right. Yeah, and I drive. Well, whatever. I drive. I carry a gun out there. Every time I'm in New Hampshire, there's a lot of guys open carry. Sure, it's like the libertarians are trying to take over. Uh, the, the free state thing, they have a thing, and the gun laws are pretty liberal and things. And that's a you know, I'm not a big gun guy. Okay. Um, I, you get way more cards if you put a gun in somebody's The coolest face. thing about the gun is if you add another letter, or no, fuck. Ah, never mind. I'm just, I have a what joke. What was it? What was it? The coolest thing about the gun 
is if you add another hump, it becomes the gum. Okay, in the carts. Right? That relates to the carts. No. Do none of these come with gum? Oh, yes, they do. They totally come with gum. Yeah, that's... that's Gun? Yes, you're right. Gun, gum, yeah. Yes. Uh, yeah, like if you were to pick the first... Yeah, I'm obsessed with this. If you were to pick the first this one that you so mentioned, cool. like Norman freaking ate the gum right away. So many people have eaten the gum. Did yeah, anybody open the Rad Dudes? I don't even know what yes. that is. Rad Dudes has been open two, two times, maybe? Is it... I, a terrorist attack? I don't buy that. Well, you know who just opened Terrorist Attack? Kurt Metzger. Dude, that's so... Damn, yeah. I fucking busted my phone. Oh, that's what happens. Terrorist people, Attack. People, people choose too early. What? I know, I can't help it. If there's a dinosaur's attack in here, I'm going to lose my shit. Nope. There, I don't have dinosaurs attack. There might be a dino, but I don't think so. I have a Mastodon card, but that's for a specific comic who, gotcha, who gotcha. won't do the show. Derek Gaines will not do the show, but he loves Mastodon, so I'm going to try This to... is great, too. Zero Heroes? I don't even, I don't know, even know that one. Terrorist attack is awesome. Yeah, that's a fun one. Sorry, that's... I'm. all my problems are coming out in your show. Yeah, it's all good. There's a Civil War deck, Wait, too. Wait, is this not... you make this? Yes, okay. because those comedians... People have opened packs I've made of comedians. Oh, like, really? Uh, Maddie uh, Wiener opened the Shane Gillis, Ari Shafir, uh, uh, Mark okay. Norman deck. Okay. For whatever reason, and then we joked about that. And then she signed one of those cards. And then I, I make cards of you guys now, like this. Okay. So then she signed a card, and, and then I made a new deck. And it's like getting to be circles and circles and circles. Gotcha. So, oh, so cool. yeah. I'm really excited about this. Yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna look up. Oh, Dinotopia. Okay. I yeah, I knew there was something. I got Dino. Vietnam yeah, cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only been open one time in Vietnam. Desert Storm cards. Never been open. Real. Yeah. Pokemon. I and like that. Yeah, a rip off a of Pokemon. That's yeah, pretty yeah. funny. Bone is a great fucking old. No one opened has opened Bone. This has a big poster. Uh, really? Uh, yeah, there's no cards. It's just a giant. It just unfolds to be a big poster of. Gibb. I don't even know who Andy Gibb is. He was one of the Gibb brothers. It was like a, uh, a big is. '70s group. Okay. Kojak, uh, Godfrey opened Kojak. He did the theme song and shit. Did he talk about how uh, all the writers said Kojak was originally supposed to be black, and that's why it was being Rams in the remake? He did not mention that. The creators of Kojak literally said we. <laughs> We had to get it, like, as all movies were at the time, they had to get an Italian because they wouldn't allow them to cast a black guy when they wanted a black guy. Yeah, right, right. It's actually it, true for Kojak. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Yeah. That's interesting. Wow. Uh, yeah. Well. Yeah, this is wow. fucking awesome. Yeah, yeah. Okay, right. well, just sign one for me and you keep right. the others. Which one do you want? It what? doesn't matter. It's what a dealer's choice. All right. We'll give, we'll give you the milk. Awesome. Well, I mean, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm the right age for that. <laughs> And, you know, everyone's like, just fuck my kid's mom. So, you know, it works out. Good for you. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Get the milk. Oh, shit. Thank you so much. And hey, go see Live Comedy, because that's where it's happening. Comedians <laughs> open Awesome. Good. Thank Thanks, you so Dave. Much.